All right, boys, you ready to play another game of golf with your friends? I love golf and I love everything about this game. I whooped you all last game and I'm ready to play again. Well, I wasn't here the last time you guys played and I intend on getting first place because I don't settle for anything less. Papa Joe is still here. I don't think I played bad last time and I know I can do better. Let's do this. All right, just a quick heads up. You guys have been assigned a color. I am the blue color. Donald is the orange color. Joe is the white color. And George is the red color. All right, let's play. Let's do this, boys. Just keep in mind that the color of the golf ball sometimes glitches. So just look at the top right of the screen to confirm whose turn it is. Sounds good, Barack. Thanks for getting that out of the way. Now it's time for us to display our golf skills. Wait, why aren't we playing in the forest map, Barack? I didn't get a chance to play that one with you guys. Come on, George, you should have known we weren't going to do that one again. But if you're great at golf, then you will do fine. I'll start us off here. Yeah, I have no clue what that was, Donald. Screw you, Barack. Are you going to be toxic again? OK, George, it's your turn. Let's see how you do. Honestly, I'm just going to full send this since Donald didn't put enough power in his shot. And of course, you have to make me the lab rat so you guys can benefit off of it. Stop crying about it, Donald. The order changes every hole. Let me show you how it's done. Well, you didn't get a hole in one, but you're most definitely acting like you would get a hole in one. Step it up, Barack. All right, well, I'm just going to aim straight with about half power. And I have to say, Joe, you will not be getting it in next turn either. Of course, you and Donald are the ones being trash. OK, Barack, you're definitely being toxic. There is no need for that. Let me prove you all wrong. Honestly, Donald, you got to put more thought into your shot. Screw you, George. you got to think of angles and power when you're attempting a shot. He's not wrong, Donald. Look at George. He finished on par while you and Joe are just suffering. Honestly, Barack, why do you feel the need to be so toxic when we're playing golf with your friends? What did I do? I'm not being toxic, Joe. I'm just stating the facts. Dang Look it. Look at how you're playing. Only you would pull some garbage like that. I'm trying to give you advice on how to play this game. Don't take it personally. OK, well, I got mines in the hole, so you don't have to act all high and mighty, Barack. It's only hole one, and King Donald is still very much in this game. I guess it will take me four attempts to complete this course, and I'm already down a few. But it's OK, though. It's only hole one. It won't get any easier for you guys. Hole one is supposed to be the easiest. All right, now it's time to stop talking and to start playing. Let me show you rookies how it's done. It'll be interesting to see how you approach this, George. Good luck. Thanks, Joe. I'm just going to yeet this shot and see where it takes me. Weren't you the one who said to be mindful of angles and power before taking a shot? What was that, George? How about you worry about yourself, Donald? Aren't you already losing to me? Well, OK, then. Guess I'll just show you what King Donald can do. I doubt you're going to do much, Donald. Oh, my god. Whoa, whoa, that whoa. was close to a hole in one. Instead, I'm all the way back there with George. The word almost doesn't mean anything in golf, Donald. All right, it's time for Papa Joe to cook. I did some studying as to how you guys approached your shots. I'm confident in this one right here. Wow, that was super close, Joe. At least you'll get it in your next turn. Nice one. Do you now see what I'm talking about, George? Anyways, it's time for the Abominator to do his thing. What are you trying to say, Barack? Be a man and spit it out? That you guys are ganging up on me. Are you serious and right of course, now? I was close to a hole in one, but this game wants to cheese me by sending me back to where Donald is. Correction, Barack. You're further away from the hole than Donald. This is exactly what I'm talking about. Screw you, Barack. You two just constantly side with each other. Are you guys being serious right now? Stop acting like kids and let me play the damn game. I would have made it in had you guys just let me concentrate. Sounds like excuses, George. Let me show you how it's done. You didn't show me much. How about you stop talking about what you're going to do and actually do it? All right, well, I can show you how it's done since I was the first one to complete this course. How about it, boys? I love seeing your improvement, Joe. Good one. And once again, Get wrecked, this Barack. game cheesed me from completing this course. Fake news. This is the second time now that I should have been done with this already. OK, so let me get this straight. What's up, George? Donald and Barack are constantly trying to argue and display as to why they're better in this game. Yep. And whenever Donald seeks for you to improve Joe, Barack gets toxic. Does that sound right? Sounds right to me. Like hell it does. They're the ones being toxic. All right, I'm going to prove why I won last game, Barack. I'm laser focused for this one. All right, well, let's see it then. Damn! Donald, what in the hell was that? You talk so much and then pull that garbage. How trash are you at this game? Well, I won last game, so that's all you need to know. All right, well, I think I know what I'm doing on this course. Hopefully, I can complete this course within three attempts. That's not a bad shot, Joe. I mean, anything is a better shot than what we literally saw from Donald just Facts. now. All right, screw you both. And of course, you guys were able to take advantage of my mistakes once again. Donald, this isn't the forest map anymore. You can't hold on to winning the easiest map of the game and then perform poorly like this. That's all facts, Barack. Wow, 
So let me get this straight. Please you do. You and George are just ganging up on me and Joe. You guys are making a mistake. Take it however you want, Donald. George and I are just trying to give you tips and suggestions as to how you should play this game. After all, you two are the ones losing right now. I didn't know this became a team game. For real. I'm just trying to focus on getting better, so hopefully I can continue doing that. Well, I can't say if you're getting better based on that shot, Joe. Screw Let you, Let me show Barack. you how a real golfer does it. I'd like to see you try Barack. You don't have a good angle to complete the course this turn. And that just happened. Why are you talking trash to Joe Barack? There is no need for that. I'm just trying to help Donald. Did you guys forget about me? I'm the one who's probably winning this game right now, if you didn't know that. George, no one cares. You most definitely will not win this game. Book it. Oh, yeah? Let's see you do something then, Donald. And of course, Donald is all bark, no bite. OK, you and George need to shut the hell up, Barack. There is no need for being this toxic when we're playing golf. Do you guys hear yourselves right now? Stop taking it to that level, Joe. It's called friendly competition. As if. You sound like a damn bully. If you can't take our constructive criticism, Joe, then you can just say so. You guys are not giving me constructive criticism. Donald was giving me constructive criticism, and it helped me become a better player. Oh, really now? Maybe you guys should take some notes on how to do that. Joe, I appreciate you standing up for me, but we just got to focus on the game now. If one of them wins, we'll never hear the end of it. I got you, Donald. I'm just going to use full power for this, and it should work. Ha ha ha, nice one, Joe. Are you sure you're still playing golf? I'm with George on this of one, Joe. What the are. hell was that? All right, if you two want to be bullies, you don't have to say anything to Joe. He barely has said anything to you guys, if anything. Direct it towards me. Well, we might have to, depending on this shot. And I guess that shot was Damn a complete it. failure. It's going to take you forever to complete this course, Donald. I told you. We're giving constructive criticism. Stop taking it personally. Preach, Barack. Let me show you how it's done since you and Joe couldn't do anything, Donald. And would you look at that? Nice shot, George. I actually stayed in the course because that's what you're supposed to do. OK, let's see if you can do the same thing, Barack. I most definitely will, Joe, because I know how to play this game. And would you look at that? The only ones who are close to complete this course are George and I. No surprise there. All right, well, I can do the same thing you know. Just because I had one bad shot, it doesn't mean that I'm a bad player. That's correct, Joe. Consistency is key. And that was a good shot from you. Keep it up. Thanks, Donald. I'm curious to see how you approach your situation since you are literally in the worst case scenario right now. Honestly, I have no clue. I'm kind of looking around and these chairs are just a complete nuisance. I'm just going to full send this and see what happens. Are you serious right now, Fuck. Donald? Do you never fucking <laughs> learn or something? How fucking dumb are you? Where was the constructive criticism in that, huh? Bullies like you are just fucking insecure. Insecure about what, Joe? You even have to admit that it was a dumb fucking shot Donald took. You gotta have a better strategy than what that. What the fuck? Oh, really now? And what the fuck was that shot, George? I don't know what I'm you're talking about. I'm not like you, about. though. I won't kick someone when they're down. I won't stoop as low as you two fucks. Don't worry about them, Joe. Just make sure you play well for your sake. Am I right? Yeah, I know, Donald, <laughs> but fuck, my finger accidentally slipped. I meant to put more power. I don't know why you're laughing, Barack, but I guess I just got to focus on making a comeback on this course, and that's exactly what I plan on doing. Well, there's plenty to laugh about, Donald. How Joe is complete booty cheeks at this game and how you're all the way back there like how Joe was in the game of life. And who won in the game of life, Barack? Facts. No one gives a shit about that luck-based game. Facts. What really matters is how you perform in a skill-based game like this one. You guys better listen to George. In the meantime, you guys can just watch my greatness as I finish this course with a birdie. All right, well, it's not about how you start, but rather how you finish. I didn't have the greatest angle to work with, but at least I'll be able to complete this course in my next attempt. That's a good way of thinking, Joe. I don't have many options as to what I can do from this point, so I'll just play this conservatively. For the first time ever, Donald, I think you actually made the right decision. I mean, it was his only choice, so it's not like he could have fucked shit up more. Perhaps that's true, Barack. But once again, I'm going to finish on par. I told you boys that I don't settle for anything less than first place. Well, I completed the course, too. No one gives a shit, Joe. Let's just watch Donald shit the bed like usual. You guys can say whatever you want, but I'm still going to play this safely to ensure that I don't trail too much this early in the game. Hate to break it to you, Donald, but you are definitely trailing a lot when you compare our scores together. You better get it together. And that was only the fourth hole, Barack. We're not even halfway done with this match. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold on, Barack. You set it to 10 holes. What the fuck are you doing? Stop your bitching, Donald. If you're better than all of us in this game, 
then you will win regardless of how many holes we're doing. Whatever you say. What the fuck was that, And I that, don't know Donald? how the fuck to do this course. Once again, I am your lab rat, so you guys just take advantage of my mistakes. This is bullshit. Once again, you're making excuses. Nothing new here. I'm just going to play smartly since that is the way to go. It's not something Donald would be able to understand. Well, since I'm doing pretty well for myself, I will do the same thing. I don't need to do any risky or stupid shit like Donald. Go fuck yourself, George. I'm just going to continue playing conservatively since I have some ground to make up. I'm not really sure what to do either, if I'm being honest, though. All right, I want another crack at this shit. My goal is to just get where you guys are and maybe more. Seems like a tall task for you, Donald. Fuck off, Barack. Just let Donald play the damn game, would you? It's fine, Joe. I'm actually pretty content with my shot, and I think I know what I have to do here. Hmm, let me take a look. Well, I guess I have an idea for what I have to do. I'll try my best and live with the results. Here we fucking go. What was that shot, Barack? Fuck you, you Donald. You're in last place. You criticize every little place. thing, so I only figured it would be fair if I did the same thing. I don't have much of an angle here, but yeah, I don't know why you're talking shit, Donald. You're literally in last place. Why are you guys so hell-bent on who's in what place right now? We're not even halfway done with this shit yet. That's because Barack and George aren't used to being first and second place. What the fuck did you say, you obese pig? Excuse me? What in the hell was that shot, Joe? When Barack said you were booty cheeks in this game, he wasn't lying. Shut the fuck up, George. I was trying to set myself up for my next attempt. All right, it's my fucking turn. Let me show you guys how to what do the this fuck? fucking course. And watch me, boys. I was so close to completing this entire course. It's all right, though. I'll do it next turn. I guess I don't have the angle to do that, so I'll just set myself up for that next turn. That's a good move, Barack. Fuck you for everything you stand for, George. You literally trashed me for doing that. But as soon as your fucking soon-to-be girlfriend Excuse does the me? same thing, you're cool with it. Fuck you. Holy shit, Joe. You obliterated George's entire career. I know. Now let me cook. What kind of fucking cooking was that, Joe? You damn near burned the entire place down. Don't you ever say that again. All right, fuck off, George. Don't act like you've been perfect this whole time. But I gotta say, it's nice to complete this course. I'm sure you and Barack can't relate to this. Let me prove you wrong, Donald. Watch me. Oh, I'm watching you, Barack. Fuck. And to be honest, I have no fucking clue what I just watched. I didn't know a pile of shit was allowed to be displayed on TV. All right, then. What about me? I can easily do that shot you did earlier, Donald. I told you that I can do it, especially since I set up for it. Don't start sticking your chest out now. Well, I can do it, too. <laughs> Don't worry about them, Joe. Just try to focus on your angle more. Once you figure that out, you'll be able to reach the other side. Keep coddling him, Donald. Let me show you how it's done. Oh, Fuck. really now, Barack? In that case, what the fuck was that shot? You were laughing at Joe, but you literally had multiple shitty shots on this course. Get it together, you insecure hoe. You're paying attention on the wrong person right now, Donald. Don't just ignore how I just did my thing on this course. Honestly, I'm at a shitty angle, so I'm just going to eat this. Here we go again. Oh, 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 fuck, steak. Are you actually serious right now? What kind of lucky bullshit is that? Well, sometimes luck is a part of success, Barack. I'm just glad that I didn't go out of bounds there. Whatever you say, Joe, let me do my thing now. Jesus fucking Christ. And you said I'm lucky. Oh, oh, stay, drop, fuck yes, let's go. That is the literal definition of luck, Barack. Your ball had so many opportunities to go out of bounds, but it didn't. Now fuck off, Donald, that's all skill. Who's ready to watch Joe fuck this shit Screw up? Screw you, George. I told you that I'm going to approach this more smart moving forward. It kind of seems like you're praying for my downfall. I don't need to pray for something that's already happened, Joe. I am way ahead of you in this game, and that is a fact. And just know that it's not about how you start, but rather how you finish. Joe, you've been using that as your fucking excuse as to why you're playing shitty. After a certain point, you have to show signs of improvement instead of relying on that saying. All right, well, focusing on the game now. I'm not sure how to really approach this, so I'm just going to play it smart. Wait! What, Barack? You playing it smart? Sorry that took me a while to process since those two don't go with each other. Haha, <laughs> nice one, Barack. George, shut your fucking Iraq-loving nipples up. Excuse me? It's fine, George. Joe is just trying to get into your head. Don't let him affect your gameplay. Man, your love for George is insane, Barack. When are you guys booking a hotel room? When are you guys getting married? Fuck you, Donald. You're literally meat-riding Joe all day, every day. All right, Barack, chill out. You literally just told me to not let Joe get in my head. Don't let Donald get in your head. You better listen to your boyfriend, Barack. Fuck off, Joe. I doubt your senile ass could even make it to where we are. I'm not even going to respond to that. I know how to do simple things in this game. Nice job for not responding to their bullshit, Joe. Keep your composure, and I'm sure you'll be able to trim the deficit. 
I highly doubt that happens, Donald. No one fucking asked for your opinion, but if I'm being honest, I have no clue what to do on this course, so once again, I will play it conservatively. That's probably the best way to go about it. All right, shut the fuck up, Joe. You don't need to comment on everything Donald does. I'm not even going to comment on that. Just hurry it up with your turn. Well, after assessing what the map kind of looks like, I think I will do the same thing and just play it safely. I don't play this game 24-7, so I don't know all the tips and tricks for this fucking game. That was a pretty solid shot, Barack. You're in range to get it in the hole within three attempts. I'll just replicate you since that feels like the best thing to do here. No surprise that you want to replicate Barack George. You two are like glue. All right, how about you focus on your teammate? For your fucking information, Joe is not my teammate, but he is someone who I wish the best for with regards to the game, since you two are definitely not doing that for him. All right, Donald, stop busting a fat one over Joe and focus on your damn turn. What does it look like I'm doing, Barack? I think I'll be okay with regards to this course. Oh, I see the little incline now. Okay, that definitely helped a lot since I didn't know exactly what was going on. If you're like me, then you will always know what's going on since the Abominator is constantly cooking. Am I right, boys? Fuck! Yeah, I don't know what the hell that was, Barack. Maybe you shouldn't talk all this shit beforehand or else it leads to embarrassment like this. Like I said before, you guys are focused on the wrong person. I am one turn away from completing this course with little to no trouble. Once again, I will not settle for anything less than first place. I can do the same thing. I can certainly make a comeback. It all starts with this course. That's a good mindset, Joe. You know what? I can also make a comeback. All it takes is one good hole and then the momentum will be in my favor. You two are super fucking delusional. There aren't that many holes left and the gap between us is bigger than you think. How about you worry about your sticky situation, Barack? You are most certainly worrying about the wrong thing, Joe. How about you worry about the fucking score? Yeah, for real. I am once again proving that I am a serious candidate for first place when it's all said and done. I guess we'll see the score after this one then, huh? Yeah, and I assure you all that this game is just getting started. All it takes is one hole for someone to fuck something up and choke their lead. Donald, why the fuck are you even talking? I think the gap between you and I is just too big at this point. Guess who's in first place, boys? Barack, you're acting like I'm down 100 to your bitch ass. Facts. I'm only down three. Facts. And Joe is only down one to you. Facts. You guys are acting like I'm not in first fucking place. No one cares, George. How many times do I have to tell you that you're focusing on the wrong person? I will continue to dominate this game and no one even cares. George, instead of asking for praise, earn it. I won the last game, which is why I deserve praise. But this game isn't fucking over. Why are you celebrating so early? I deserve praise. Maybe you can get a participation award after this, but it looks like everyone is doing the same strategy here, huh? Papa Joe will find a way to make this comeback. Not if I can help it, Joe. I will continue asserting my dominance by putting myself in prime position to complete this course within three attempts. And once again, Barack, you are cooking. Good shit. We fucking get it already. Hurry up and make out already. Get the fuck out of here with your stupid sus-ass bullshit, Donald. Are you serious right now? Is this a desperation attempt from your obese ass so you can try distracting us? Like hell it is. There is some serious meat riding that's going on right now. And it doesn't fucking help when George gets so lucky with the ghost saving George's position like that. Excuses, excuses, and more fucking excuses, Donald. Just chill out, Donald. It's all good. I'm going to focus on doing the best I can, and I hope that's good to complete the comeback. Was that turn of yours doing the best you could, Joe? That was some pathetic ass shit, I'm not gonna lie. Well, Joe didn't have the ghost saving his ass like George did. All right, that's enough from you all. Time to watch how a first place player does it. Fuck! Oh yeah, I definitely saw a lot coming from a first place player. That is exactly why I said it's not about how you start, but rather how you finish. Don't fall apart now, George. Let's see this, Donald. Are you fucking kidding wrecked, me right now? Get wrecked, you fat now? bitch. Shit like that pisses me off because when I already know I'm going to complete the greatest comeback of all time in golf with your friend's history, Shit like that has to happen, huh? And the same thing happened to me, Donald. I was so close to completing this course, it's so frustrating. Okay, you two are so fucking delusional that it's not even funny at this point. Let me show you how it's done, Joe and Donald. It's not that fucking complicated. Good shot, George. Maybe if you two were good at the game, you would be in my situation. But instead, you guys are enjoying third and fourth place. Last time I fucking checked, George, it took the same amount of attempts for us to complete this course. Why are you acting like you did better than us or some shit? Because you don't have many opportunities left to make this fucking comeback, Donald. Facts. And of course, I am going first, and since I literally have no fucking clue what to do, this is just a wasted turn. Now you guys will benefit off of my mistakes. This is bullshit. Keep crying about it, Donald. 
I'm not going to pick sides here, but wouldn't you all agree that if there's something tough to figure out, the first person to try it first will have the worst chances of being successful at it? When will you two stop with your fucking delusion and stupidity? Don't blame us. Blame your skill. It's clearly not good enough to compete with me or even Barack. And this is exactly why I say that you two have to take constructive criticism instead of getting butt hurt by taking shit personally. There is a huge player diff here, boys. Okay, whatever you say. Now that I'm done being the lab rat, it's time for King Donald to come back in this game. This game still has a few holes left. Don't think for one second that these standings will remain the same. I am confident in my abilities to make something special happen. Yeah, yeah, whatever you say, Joe. As long as George and I play consistently safe, there is no way in hell that we will lose our leads to your bum asses. I think this is just something that you and Donald have to accept, Joe. The reality is that you two suck ass in this game. I don't know how last game went down, but ever since I've been here, you two have been complete ass. And your presidency was complete ass, but you got away with it, right? Okay, 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 okay. Donald, you don't have to bring politics into this game. We can talk shit and do what we gotta do, but that is the one thing we're not bringing in. I will not tolerate that shit. Do you understand me? All right, fine, that's my bad. I just let my frustrations get the best of me. My bad, George. I told you this before, Donald. If you accept the fact that you and Joe will finish third and fourth place, then the less frustrated you two will be over time. Okay, but in all seriousness, is everyone just doing the same fucking thing? Way to have fun. George and I aren't trying to choke our leads, Joe. You don't have to get salty. I guess I understand where you're coming from, Barack. After all, you had a major meltdown in the game of life Fuck by you. choking that big lead of yours to Joe. All right, you're thinking about the wrong game. I know you tried bouncing off the targets, but once again, you failed. Worry about what's in front of you. Let's see you do something then. Well, how's that for doing something? Although it's nothing flashy or anything of that sort, I'm going to complete this turn in my next fucking turn that way. It ensures my lead. Anyone can do that, Barack. It's not that hard. And are you fucking kidding me right now? Once again, I barely missed the hole. That would have put a dent in your lead, Barack, and you know it. How in the actual fuck is everyone forgetting about me? I've been in first place for a long time now, and it's just pathetic that you guys can't even recognize my greatness. You guys will pay the price for that. Whatever you say, George, I'm going to aim this shot so perfectly that the ball will go in this turn. Can't wait to see what that disaster looks like. Good luck, Donald. Seriously, Donald? That shot didn't even put the ball close to the hole. And you really thought you were going to do something? Yeah, that was pretty pathetic, Donald. I can't relate, though, since I have been cooking this whole damn match. Don't think you're the only one who can make it in this turn, Barack. I'm right behind you. Yeah, you're definitely a threat to me, Joe. I'm so scared. I can do this shit with my eyes closed, Joe. Hitting it in from this angle is nothing. Stop patting yourself on the back for something so easy. Guys, I kind of forgot Donald was even in this game. He's been so quiet after the embarrassment he had to endure from talking shit. All right, fuck off, Barack. There are still two holes left. Anything can happen. Are you fucking stupid, Donald? Do you see the score? Nothing suggests that you will make this comeback. Whatever you say, Barack, and once again, I'm going first since this game wants to cheat me out of opportunities for making this comeback. Every time I'm the goddamn lab rat. Maybe you should focus more on what you should do before just shooting aimlessly. Facts. All right, Donald, don't listen to them. If anyone knows the game of golf, then you should know that it's possible to fuck a hole or two up and lose your lead quickly. Stay humble, bitches. The only reason why you made it across the obstacle, Joe, was because you saw Donald's bum ass fail. Don't act like you're good now. What the fuck are you talking about, Barack? Joe and I are in a similar place. How did I fail? I think it's because he views you as a fucking loser. What the fuck? All you do is take L's Donald, including this game when it's all said and done. And once again, Donald, we're all doing the same thing. Like I said before, there is no way that George and I are losing our lead so you can kiss your delusional ass. Come back, hopes, goodbye. Well, this course looks fucking confusing, so who knows what will happen. Facts. Are you serious, Donald? This looks pretty straightforward to me. Yeah, I guess we'll see about that. Time to make something happen. Oh, you definitely Fuck. made something happen, Donald. You definitely ensured your fourth place finish. I always believe in the saying, it's not over till it's over. Here we go again. I have the heart of a champion, and there is no way that I will give up regardless of how many times you and George tell me to. Do you hear me? I hear you, Joe. Fuck! But you're not backing that up. What in the fuck was that shot? What goes through your brain when you do shit like that? I can't even comprehend because I'm not that fucking stupid. I don't know, Barack. Maybe Donald can comprehend that. Ha 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 Go fuck yourself, George. Okay, did you seriously just make fun of Donald when you pulled that shit, George? You're a big hypocrite, you know that. Well, it doesn't matter since I'm still going to get first place. Yeah, I don't know about that, George. Wait, what? 
Did your dumbass forget that you were only up one to Barack? You've been saying that you're going to get first fucking place this entire time, but it looks like you're going to choke that shit away. Fuck off, Donald. You're not even close to first place. But I at least won a game. Can you say the same thing? Facts. All right, Donald, enough talk. Let's see what you can do. And once again, Donald doing his dumbass shit. Might as well just call him dumbass Donald at this point. And what should we call you, George? How about gave away first place, George? All right, Joe, with all due respect, I don't think you have the right to say that. You're not getting first place this game, and it's not like you've won a match yet in this game either. Listen to your daddy, Joe. Barack is fucking your shit up. Nah, screw that. I'm still in this, and I don't care what anyone says about that. You better not go out of bounds again, George. Don't choke this shit away. Don't worry, Barack. If I make a mistake, I learn from it. That's just the kind of person I am. Kind of like when you kept sending troops to the Middle East when we were playing Risk, right? Fuck out of here with your bullshit. Yeah, even I can't deny that. And of course, I don't have a good angle to work with in order to progress with the course. This is exactly the start of the comeback that I've been talking about the whole time. Just watch me, boys. King Donald is on his way. Holy shit, Donald. You got so fucking lucky that you didn't just stay in the out-of-bounds area. That would have looked so bad on your part. Yeah, but he's fine. It's time for me to do what you couldn't do, Barack, and that's to have a solid angle with regards to progressing on this course. There is no fucking way that you're talking to me like that at this point of the game. Don't listen to them, Barack. Watch my greatness in the meantime. What kind of greatness was that, George? That looked like dog shit, if I'm being honest. You know what else is dog shit, Donald? Being in fourth fucking place. All right, I'm going to eat my shit and try making up for what I lost last turn. That is so lucky, Barack. You had no care for the world when it came to your angle, aim, and power. What did you say, Joe? Sometimes you need luck in order to be successful, am I right? Oh, fuck! Listen to your own shit. And what in the fuck was that bullshit? Donald, you got so lucky. That's all skill. King Donald is back in the game, believe me. Since I have no option, I have to play it safely here. I just hope I can still make this comeback despite not having many options left. Hearing your delusion, Joe, is making my head hurt. Get it together, you old hag. You did not just call me an old hag, you old hag. Okay, all of you guys, shut the fuck up. All of you guys are old hags. I didn't even say anything, though. I don't fucking care, Donald. I gotta focus up here so I can get to the other side. And of course, oh shit! I was so close to getting it in the hole. At least I didn't go out of bounds like some fucking people. Get the fuck out of here with your passive aggressive bullshit, Barack. And this is not the first time that I should have gotten the ball in right then and there. I was so close. It doesn't matter if you were so close. All right, it's time for Papa Joe to make some noise. I believe I can hit this well in a fucking course. I was super close like Donald. When shit like this happens, it makes the comeback even harder. When will you two stop with your delusional ass comeback thoughts? And if you want to talk about some bullshit, that is the literal definition of bullshit. My ball was already in the hole and it came out. Oh, really now? Don't respond to that, George. I'm sure Joe was going to turn that into some sus-ass bullshit. Are you fucking kidding me right <laughs> now? Get wrecked, you guys Donald. keep distracting me and that is the reason why I missed. No, that is not the reason why you missed. The reason why you missed is because you suck at this game. Whatever you say, George. What in the actual fuck was that? Every time you talk shit, George, this happens. Facts. This is exactly why no one is giving you your fucking praise. Facts. The entire fucking game. You were first place. Facts. The entire fucking game. You were demanding respect. Facts. The entire fucking game. You demanded attention. Facts. For what? To just be choking in the spotlight, huh? Big fucking facts. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. That shit went hard, Joe. Come on, George, you can't choke like this and you know it. This course seems more simple than most of the other ones, so it's hard to believe that this is the last one. I just hope that there's enough time for me to make some kind of comeback. For fuck's sake, Joe, there is no comeback. I'm just going to copy your strategy, though, for this course to ensure that shit doesn't happen. Don't say that as if it's your first time copying us, George. You and Barack have been doing that all game, which is also a huge reason why you guys are even up. You're going to do the same thing. Donald, don't be a fucking hypocrite. Except I won't be. Wait, what? I'm going to bounce off the left target, and then I saw another one that bounces me even closer to the hole but I don't analyze the course right. That was some good strategizing, Donald. You did what no one else did, and you're definitely going to make up some ground with regards to the deficit against Barack and George. Question is, though, will it be enough? I will answer that, no. How about you focus on not choking any more than you already did? You already choked away first place. Who's to say you won't choke away second place? Well, how about this shot right here then, Joe? Bullshit. I told you I wouldn't choke this game away, and if anything, I am the favorite to get first fucking place. Respect me, bitches. How many times do we have to tell you that respect is earned, not given? Fuck. I can't believe that George is going to end up winning this shit. 
I essentially did the same shot he did with the same power, angle, and aim, and somehow his ball got over the hump. This is some bullshit. But it's not for sure that George is going to win Barack. You want to know why? Why Joe? Because George knows the deep within. He is a choker. What the fuck? When the lights shine on him, he gets tense and he chokes. Excuse when me? When he has expectations, he chokes. Call him at the Atlanta Falcons or the 2016 Warriors. I can sense the future. He is definitely going to Ain't choke. Ain't no fucking way fuck that he fuck actually fuck choked. Fuck, fuck, fuck. What in the fucking world, Joe? How do you predict that? Holy shit, you're fucking amazing. I don't even know how you predicted that shit, Joe. That was impressive, I'm not gonna lie. You psychologically tormented George just like how you did that when you made Barack and I call you daddy when we were fuck? playing Pokemon. That's scary. Hey, George. What, Joe? You're gonna choke again, aren't you? I can feel it. Fuck out of here, I'll be fine. Well, okay then, no pressure, don't choke. What's gonna happen? George is going to choke. Fuck, 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 fuck. Oh my God, Joe, every time you somehow just know, what in the actual fuck? That shit is so impressive. Whoa, 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 hold on now. Did George actually choke away first place? I need to see the fucking score. Oh my That's God, I sure. won in golf with your friends. Let's fucking go, GG boys. That was super fun and competitive. Overall, the gap of the scores wasn't as big as I thought it would be. That being said, I gotta go, but I'm down to play this soon. Same here, Barack. I need some fucking revenge. GG to everyone except Joe. Fuck you, Joe. GG, boys. Next time, I will overcome the meat riding between Barack and George. GG anyways. GG, boys. Papa Joe will cook next time. Until then, 